I'm Colt Stevens from Horseshoe Farms, and today we're going to be reviewing the Connecticut Valley Arms Scout Rifle V2 Stainless Steel. This is the model CR4830S is the exact one on this one. That's the manufacturer's part number for this model. This is a 450 Bushmaster centerfire rifle, of course. Um, all stainless steel single shot. It's a break open action. Um, it's really a budget gun. Um, there are, of course, higher end ones. Um, this is CBA's premium line, so this is one of the best ones that they have out there. It's still in the budget range. Um, I think, according to their website, the MSRP is around 464. I think it's 460, uh, right around 500 is the MSRP on this one. Um, for a 450 Bushmaster, that's not too bad at all. Uh, most of the ones, like the Ruger uh, Scout Rifle, push them a thousand dollars, so right around half the price on this one right here. So this is truly a, a good value. Uh, if you're looking for the 450 Bushmaster cartridge, this is definitely going to be a uh, option for you if you want to stay below the $500 range. You know, this definitely would make it there. Um, it is by no means a cheap rifle. I mean, that's good quality for what you're getting. I mean, you, you're getting some value here. So this will be an unboxing and review. So we'll go over the features um, that we have here and we'll of course take it out of the box. Let's go ahead and pull this out and see what we got here today. Very nice. So here it is, right here. First impression, very nice got a good weight to it. I was thinking it would be a little bit lighter, but that's a, uh, a wide barrel. I guess for 450 Bushmaster it would have to be. Very nice. This is actually my first time seeing it, so this is genuine. Uh, I have not seen one of these before. This is actually the first CV I've ever, I've ever seen in person. Uh, I've heard a lot about them, but they are, they are very good. So you, you have the fluting here on the barrel. You have your stainless matching muzzle brake right there. Matches up nicely. Got the cutouts all the way around right there. A little bit of machining mark right there. Not too bad. It comes right off. I guess it's just wear from the finish. Very nice. So from the manual, I did read the manual. This is a brake open. Brakes open right here. Here we are. Gotta work it a little bit to get it open, but there it is. So pull back on this and it breaks open right there. Definitely a 450 Bushmaster cartridge. Uh, you got some big bore there. Good rifling. Very nice rifling. Looks to be five or six groove rifling. Um, five grooves of rifling in there. Comes with the integrated um, scope rail there. Um, I believe it's a Weaver. Um, they they have a special name for it. Let me see if they see what that is. I'm sure they see on their website. Um, but this is basically a Weaver rail um, already integrated into it for a scope. And this is the synthetic stock model. Of course, you have some checkering here, some good ergonomics going there. Got some up here. You have two sling swivels, one right here and one right here at the rear. Um, one feature I did notice um, from their website is the comb back here is ambidextrous, so you can shoot this left or right-handed. You have the cheek here and the cheek piece there. So this is truly an ambidextrous rifle right on the box. Um, that is definitely a feature it has over things like the uh, Ruger Scout rifle, which is going to be a right hand or left hand only. They make it in a left hand, but it's pricier and it's much harder to find. Um, so if you're left-handed, this is a good choice for you. You're definitely getting the value there. Um, it's going to be used universal left or right hand. So that's nice right out of the box. Um, they also have this hammer spur right there. You can see there. You have a little bit extra there. This is reversible. So you can put that on the left or the right. That's a very nice feature. Going back to the ambidextrous um, use here. So that's very good. Um, 
very excellent right out of the box. That, that, that does not feel like a cheap rifle. I would definitely say a lot more than 500 just from the feel of it alone. Uh, it seems to be the fit and finish of more expensive rifles from my experience. Um, the butt pad right here, this is a proprietary, they call this the crush zone um, recoil pad. And this comes standard on their bigger bore, um, 450 Bushmaster being a big bore caliber. Um, pretty nice, very, very soft feeling. We'll take up some recoil with that. So let's see what else comes in the box. We have a key lock right there. And we have the manual right there. There's also a registration card. Registration card, the manual, and I think a warranty card comes in here. It appears to be everything in the box. So let's go over the features. This is a 25 inch barrel stainless steel, fluted, of course. Um, they don't actually say what the threads are on this one. Um, I have to do some research on that one. I don't want to tell you the wrong thing. Um, I couldn't even guess what it is right offhand because the, uh, the AR 450 Bushmaster I think is different depending on which brand you get. So uh, the 450 Bushmaster is not really standard. Um, 5 8 by 24 is definitely not correct because that would be a 30 cal. Um, there was one that was like 5 8 by 36 but I couldn't tell you whether that is right, right here. It is removable, the muzzle brake is removable, so if you find out what threads these are, you can get aftermarket accessories to go on this rifle. So that is a very neat feature. Uh, I'm not going to try and get that off because I bet they put Loctite on it um, from the factory so it doesn't move. And that's, that's a smart thing you do. You don't want that to fly off, especially with a big bore high pressure caliber like 450 Bushmaster. So, um, black synthetic stock, rail already included. And 100% ambidextrous, crush zone recoil pad, 1 and 24 twist um, is the barrel on this one if you're curious. Um, 7.5 pounds overall, good weight. Uh, we read the Mossberg Patriot last night. A um, little bit heavier, better balanced I would say. It's, it's got a natural point right about there, uh, maybe a little bit. about there is the natural point of balance right there. Um, 41 inches overall um, complete. It's a little bit shorter. Um, 25 inch barrel of course you've got a long barrel and a short package. You don't have a whole lot back here. This is a 14 inch length of pull uh, adult standard. Um, I think they make shorter ones. Um, they make youth models if you're interested. They do have those. That is a variant that they offer. And CVA, um, Connecticut Valley Arms, does offer a lifetime warranty on these rifles if you should ever need um, to have them serviced. So that's very nice. They, they stand behind their product and even for a budget gun, they'll service it. So you're definitely getting your value out of this one. Um, CVA, not really a brand I would have considered before looking at this, but you really get some value out of this. I'm, I'm very elegantly surprised. I like that. CVA has really done a good job with this. I have not considered one before now. Um, so if you're in the market for a cheap 450 Bushmaster, this one should definitely be close to the top of the list, if not the best one. Um, I have not seen very many cheaper than this. I mean, this is good value for what you're getting. So that's all I have for you today. Um, thanks for watching. Please check the link in the description and please like and subscribe.